what is up y'all welcome to the new video so I hope you enjoyed the workout I had this morning as you saw it was an upper body workout and bruh, okay anyways as you saw it was an upper body workout pretty happy because I got up to 260 pounds for a set of three on bench and then dude and then just went on and did some accessory work but making it overall a really successful workout afterwards went home and showered and I just ate some Chipotle and I literally was eating my Chipotle and I bit something hard and it was a freaking rock no lie I bit into a rock at Chipotle that was kind of weird biting into a rock at Chipotle but whatever I still love it and right now I'm now leaving Chipotle to go somewhere because if you saw my last video there was something I couldn't tell you guys and I'm going to that place right now so let's head over there right now tattoo parlor I'm getting ready to get my first ever tattoo um, I'm gonna surprise you guys with what it is though and where it is so you guys will see that in the next clip right now all right guys so <clears throat> here is my tattoo it's hard I know probably hard to see right now but what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna throw a screenshot in the clip right now I overall I love this tattoo uh, it, it says, you probably, I mean, you probably read it, but it says one day at a time. And I also wanted to throw in a little cross in there, but not make it too much. So perfect in my opinion. Um, super happy with how it turned out. And I, I freaking love it. For those of you guys who don't, do not know, though, uh, well, the main purpose for this cross is two year, oh, almost two years ago, um, on October 3rd, 2016, um, my Uncle George uh, passed away. Um, one of the things he always always said was one day at a time that was just kind of like his thing just live life one day at a time and when he passed that was just I took a lot from that and I've kind of lived by that quote since he had passed away and um, so I one I wanted to get something to symbolize him but also symbolizes me at the same time and I love this quote and I love him I miss him so just I have a good reason for this tattoo and I love it and I hope you guys like it as well so Outside of the tattoo, it is the following day since I got it. And I know you're like, dude, you can't be in the sun. I can be in the sun for about 20 to 30 minutes. I'm just going to be out here for about 10 to 15, though, doing some prowler work. Um, I did my workout. I did an arm workout today. Just did some sprints on top of the track of our basketball court at our school. Now I'm out in the field getting ready to do some sprints So with the prowler. So let's get some clips for you guys right here, and I'll talk to you all in just a second. So, finished up doing all my workout stuff earlier, um, and afterwards I went and edited the video that is up before this one, so go check that one out if you guys have not already. Uh, and I just left the dentist office, actually. I got my teeth all cleaned up, nice and white. Um, and I also talked about getting my wisdom teeth taken out, but that won't be happening until like December. So I got a while before that, which is good. I'm gonna do it after football season. But um, right now, my brother and I, because we both went to the dentist, are going to eat at Taco Mac. Um, and because <laughs> shit, <laughs> and and because I uh, started dieting or watching what I'm eating Monday, I am gonna get some grilled chicken most likely while I'm here. So, let's go in there and I'll show you guys what I get to eat. Alright guys, so it is way later uh, in the day right now. I had a good time with my brother earlier at um, Taco Mac. I got three grilled chicken tenders and for those of you who like french fries, a healthier option for french fries is sweet potato fries. It's not like a crazy difference, but I mean any little bit you can get to make it a little healthier um, is good. So definitely recommend you guys instead of doing french fries. If a place has sweet potato fries, definitely get those. It is the healthier option for sure. Um, after I came home and I actually did a bunch of stuff, I had a lot of stuff I had to get done. I had to get a video posted, I had to clean my room up, take the trash, um, 
And the biggest thing that takes a lot of the time was um, for, uh, since I just graduated, I got sent a lot of cards from people and so I had to send them thank you notes for those and there was a bunch of them. Um, so I had to do a few of those today as well. And then the, I had this thing due for Furman that is basically, if I don't fill it out, I won't be able to play. So I had to fill that out and that took about 20 minutes. So just had some small stuff I had to get done, but it kind of added up time. Um, and afterwards I was pretty tired just because I got up earlier this morning to go to the gym. Um, but now I'm rested and I feel good. So I'm going to go snack some food right now at uh, Chick-fil-A. So let's make our way there. Enjoyed my meal at Chick-fil-A. Uh, afterwards, actually went and bowled and then hung out with a few friends for a little bit. And it is actually 1.45 right now. Um, and I'm pretty hungry. I just got home. And I'm gonna ha I haven't really ate too much today, actually. And I ate pretty good. So what I'm gonna do, one of my favorite like snacks is maple brown sugar oatmeal. Maple brown sugar oatmeal is the best oatmeal. I don't care what y'all say. Maple brown sugar is the way to go. And when I try to make it more of a more of a filling type of meal not like a snack because if I just have one packet that's a snack that's like a give me some energy for a workout or something um, but because I'm trying to have a legit like meal before I go to bed I'm doing two packets of it and then I'm throwing in some of this um, sugar-free breakfast syrup some crunchy peanut butter and then you're gonna throw a scoop of cereal milk protein powder in there to add a little more protein to it. Um, this will fill me up and will get me through the night. Um, and yeah, so that's what I'm gonna be having right now. And I'm actually gonna go ahead and end this video here. So I hope you guys have enjoyed. I hope y'all like my tattoo. Um, I love it. I really, really love it. My parents like it. Um, and again, it has that reason and it's just means something to me. So. Overall, I love it and I hope you guys like it as well. So thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you for the support. Like and subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next video.